Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today I'm unstuffing from my envelopes. I have some things that I purchased using my card that I need to take back to the bank. It's not too much, so yeah, don't have too much to take back. Only $104. And I'm also going to try to condense. I might be able to, I don't have like a lot of larger bills, but I know I have lots of fives that might need, might need to be condensed a little bit in some of these envelopes. So I'm gonna first start off with the unstuffing. Actually in my wallet, I have some coffee money I've um, already spent. I like to use the app to pay for coffee, especially at work because my coworker goes to pick it up. So I have to place the order on my app and then she goes and picks it up for us. Um, so I usually reload like $10 each time I, yeah, that I put money on there. Um, so that is $30 that I already spent for coffee. And actually I'm gonna get a little, I like to highlight and check off. So that is coffee. Okay. Um, let's see. Next, I have I have eating out, but I don't have change yet, so I'm going to hold off on this until I get a little bit more change if I can. Actually, you know what I can do? Uh, I can No, I can't do that. Okay, yeah, I need a little bit more change. I'll come back to the eating out one. Uh, let's see. Coffee done. Buffer. Okay, so I have family. Um, I went to Vaughn's and I bought some things for Thanksgiving dinner, which I've been using family to fund that for. Okay, I'm going to take this 10 from family. And I'm just going to swap it for my buffer money here. I think I have enough, actually. I don't know. I don't think I spent it. No, I didn't. Okay, so five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I'm just going to use this to make change from family. Okay, so I need eight dollars. Five, six, seven, eight. I'll go back in here and I'm not going to update my trackers or anything on this because they're still in my wallet and I will do that later in a different video. I actually do that at the end of my shop with me videos, but I don't think I'm filming one of those this week. So I will do it um, when I'm done with this envelope. I will update it when I put it back in here, but I'm not ready to do that yet. So let me just check this off here. It's just been a crazy week, so I felt like one less thing I need to worry about. Um, so I didn't want to film that for this week just because it's just been super, super busy <laughs> trying to get everything done. Um, and I have to still like go and make some things for dinner tomorrow. So, so yeah, excited for that. All right. Household, I do need $12 from this one, which I don't have change. Okay, I really, really, really need change. Um, so I would need eight. I guess I, well, I could take this actually. Okay, so I need twelve dollars. So twenty, and I'm gonna give myself eight back. So five, six, seven, eight, which is my change. Okay, so that is um, household. I just had to buy something on Amazon, so. That's what that is for. Okay, I think I'm going to come back again. I have to come back to my wallet for eating out, but I will move on to a new binder. And I'm going to go to electronics. Maybe I have a 10 in here. Ah, I do. Okay, perfect. So I have 10. And that is all good. And this, I will update my track, update my tracker. So 20, 25, 26 in electronics. So 26. All right, so that is good now. 
Okay, next is, I don't think my, I have anything else in here. So let me go to my gray binder. Content. I actually have two envelopes, so I have, or I have two purchases for content. So I have 16 and two, so I need $18 out of here. Don't have that. So let me do hobbies first. Maybe I can get some change from there. We'll see. Might not be able to, but I'm going to try. So hobbies is, I definitely suggest if you do this, like get some change to make it a little bit easier, but I kind of like the challenge. So I'm going with it. Okay, so I got hobbies, which I need 12 from here. Nope. Okay, so yeah, I definitely need change. So I'm just gonna go into my savings binder because I have a bunch of bills in here that I can pull from. Which bills do I wanna pull? Because I kind of wanted to leave these as they are. Let's see, do I have change here? Nope. Okay, so I'm gonna look. I mean, I can grab from here. At the end of the day, it's all good. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna make myself, let's make it a little bit easy on myself. I'm just gonna grab $10 from here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Put that over here. Okay, that'll help. Alright, so now that I have that, I can work out of this this one. Okay, so in here I have hobbies which I need 12. Okay, so I have 15, so I'm gonna give myself $3 back. And that leaves me with 50, 75, 76, 77, 78. And hobbies, 78 minus 12, or 90 minus 12 is 78. Okay. Okay, so that one's good now. That was hobbies. Alright, so that's it for the pink binder. And then I have, I'll do content next, which I need 18. I'll just do these two tens for 20. Oops, not there. And then I'll give myself $2 back. So now I have 20, one, two, three, four, $24 in content. good and then that is these two here oops all right and then last one is yeah it should be good okay last one is eating out so I went to Chick-fil-a and that was $14 um so here is that one $20 I'm just gonna give myself six back for that. So I have 10, 15, 16 left for eating out. So that one is all good. All right. So I should have 104 here now that everything's checked off and highlighted. I'm just going to double check my totals. So I have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 91, and 1, 2, 3, 4. Perfect. 104. Now, I could possibly condense with these 20s and 10s. I'm going to see how far that'll get me. And yeah, just condense a little bit in these envelopes. So it's always worth checking before I take money back to the bank. I always just like to do that. Okay, so this one's all good. I'm going to be getting a oil change soon because I need to get that taken care of. Um, so that'll be coming out soon. 
emergency. Oh, that one's good. Like I might not have a lot, but I still like to check. Okay, this one has 120, which I think this one's pretty good. Yeah, that one's good. Furniture looks good. Rainy day looks good. Road trip is good. Sensi maybe. Okay, I could do a 20 here. So that's 20, 40, 55, 56, 57. Uh, subscriptions looks pretty good. Travel. Mm, I could do a 20 here, but I think I might leave this one as it is. So maybe that 20 would be better in here. In my savings binder. And this challenge. This one's starting to get pretty full quick, so I don't know. Well, I could do a 10. Okay, at least I got a 10 over here. That one's pretty good. And then, let's see, I have this one over here. Not this one, this is Star Notes, which I've actually been on the lookout for Star Notes, and I have not had any luck with Star Notes recently. Okay, that one's good. I was kind of on a roll when I first started looking for Star Notes, um, but recently, like, nothing, nothing has come up. I'm going to go through the pink envelope for the binder. This one. Mm, okay, I'll put the 20 in here. Yeah. So I already have a thousand in the bank for Go Wild. So I have 50, 70, 90, 110, 115. 1,000, 115 total for Go Wild. They're finally like starting to do stuff like announce thing, not announce like when a Go Wild is going to happen. It's a and if you're not sure what Go Wild is, it's a planner event I, I've been attending the past few years. Um, they haven't announced where it's going to be. They haven't announced when it's going to be. But I've been saving to, you know, go on this trip. Usually it's in the spring, but I don't know. That seems kind of short for, seems too soon for that to happen. So it might happen later. I don't know. I'm still waiting to hear when and to see if I can even go when it does happen because I have another trip planned later in the fall that year, so next year. So I don't know, I might interfere with it and that would be a big, big bummer, but yeah, it is what it is. Um, all right, treat yourself. Nope. Okay, so far all these look pretty good. I probably, I keep saying that I need to like get larger bills soon to condense this a little bit more because so far it's looking pretty good. All right, I have one envelope in here. Oh, my Christmas envelope. Oh, it's in my other binder, okay. I have, it's in my wallet actually, so I will come back to that one. I'm going here, clothing. That one's good. Because at this point I can only do like really tens. Content is fine. Gifts is fine. Home, uh, it looks good. Okay, I'm just gonna check my wallet. Sorry, super boring. I feel couldn't really do much in my when it comes to condensing. Um, that one's good. Holiday decor. I could do a ten. It's actually in here. So that is. 30? Yeah, I haven't spent anything yet from here. I've been meaning to. I want to buy some wreaths for my um, doors. Ooh, I can condense this. 5, 10, 15, 20. So I can do two tens. Okay, so that is 20, 30, 45, 46. And Christmas. I need to buy wrapping paper and ribbon and stuff like that. Okay, family. Oh my goodness, look at where all the ones are. Jeez Louise, that would have saved me some time. 
Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Sometimes I just don't know where the ones are. I should have looked first, but I just don't want to take the time to do that. 10, 25, 26 in family. And target. Good and household. Mm -mm. Okay, I think I need to do a 10 in here. All right, so let me do a 10. And that's $13 in household. Okay, so since now I feel like we'll see if I have 10 in there. I don't know if I do. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, I'm a dollar short. You know what? I'm going to do. Okay, I take it. My buffer I switched. Okay, I'm just going to take. Um, a one actually no I'm gonna take a one out of groceries <laughs> just because I want to put the ones back in my one dollar challenge because I just wanted all the bills to be the same because I always do a video like showing how much I this is purely for content purposes so you know so it's some things I have to just keep in mind for video ideas one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And I want like well, when I when I show all the women and stuff, this the challenges for the month soon, like this week, because we're at the end of the month. And I want all the bills to be like for the ten dollar challenge. I want them all to be tens for the five dollar challenge. I want them all to be fives. As you know, one dollar challenge, all ones. So I just want to put the ones back in here and take the ten and put it over here. I feel like I messed up somewhere though. Oh, I'll be a dollar more. That's right. Okay. So my total is going to be a little bit different, but I'm totally fine with that. I just wanted to make sure I was math. the math was correct. The math is totally mathy. So I'm good. Um, but, because it threw me off that I had no ones anymore. I took them all. I was supposed to have 104 over here. But since I added that extra one from the groceries envelope just so that way I can get the ones back over there now I'm at 105 here okay just so we're all on the same page so I'm just gonna count make sure I, I do have 105 1 10 20 30 40 50 60 65 70 75 80 85 90 95 105 perfect okay so that is it for this video thank you so much for watching um, I hope you enjoyed sorry it wasn't like super exciting but just like the normal purchases and small little unstuffing which is nice to just get that back to the bank also just trying to condense as much as I can because I like to do that before I take money back to bank to the bank especially if I have 20s or anything higher um it's nice to just go through the envelopes and I like actually going through the envelopes just to get a sense of where I'm at in each one kind of I like going through the envelopes I like counting the money so that's fun too uh, but yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. If you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button and I will see you in the next one.